The UK has a huge potential uh, resource base, particularly for shale gas and oil. The British Geological Survey over the course of the last few years have been doing a number of estimates. Uh, the biggest uh, uh, field is the Bowen Basin. That starts off in Blackpool, goes down into Cheshire, doglegs into the East Midlands and up into Yorkshire. Uh, there are estimated mid-case uh, 1,300 trillion cubic feet of gas under the ground. To give that uh, a comparator, we currently use 3 trillion cubic feet uh, in the UK. Of course, we're not going to get all of that gas out of the ground uh, for either technical, economic or social reasons. The main basins in the UK are the Bolan Basin, uh, which is, uh, starts in Blackpool, goes into the East Midlands uh, and up into Yorkshire. There are also uh, the Weald and Wessex basins in, in, in the south going from Kent uh, through to Somerset. There are also uh, deposits in um, South Wales and also in the Midland Valley of Scotland. The oil and gas regulation is going to be devolved to Wales and Scotland, but currently it's very similar to the, UK, the rest of the UK. Um, we had a uh, major uh, round uh, of licence uh, announced at Christmas uh, last year. Um, uh, 170 new licences in, in the UK. Uh, that brought in a number of new players, including Ineos, the large chemical company, uh, which was good news for, for the industry. Uh, the future now really comes down to what is under the ground, what the geology looks like, whether the gas flows and how much it costs. Uh, and the industry then will take uh, those decisions into the next step, which will be a production environment, which we hope to be into by the end of the decade. New information will become available as each company starts to drill into the, into the geology. And we know there is gas under the ground, we know how much there is. The reality now is, is will, will the geology let it come out and how will it flow and how much will it cost?